taking the canvas of the stretcher bars and consequently of the easel allows me a whole new approach to painting. The act of painting is not one of a brush moved by the wrist, but instead a gesture of the whole body performed upon a canvas that seems to lose its boundaries. While handling the canvases, they feel like a second skin. They're almost asking to be a second skin. Instead of dealing head-on with four corners of a rigid frame, I have a loose canvas that I can lay on the floor, kneel over, turn around, hang on the wall. The canvas is unprimed, and so it absorbs the ink paint and is stained by it. This practice negates the fear painters often experience while confronting the white, empty canvas. It allows more freedom. It is an intuitive and unpredictable process in which the image is inherent to the action and emerges from it. The collage pieces of canvas form a multi-layered surface, elevated like a topographic map. The patches look like bandages meant to heal the wounded, bleeding surface. In this series of paintings, the human figure gets smaller and more vulnerable, hanging there, searching for a safe land on one hand, yet maybe coming to new terms with nature and its grandeur. In what seems like a chaotic landscape, I too am wandering, seeking for something to hold on to. I destroy and rebuild, wrote Eva Hesse in her journal. I feel that this is where I'm at in this body of work.